What's up guys, good morning. It's 10 a.m. here on Friday and uh, it's a big weekend for Pokemon. I realize we don't really cover a ton of Pokemon on this channel, uh, especially as of late. I mean, we, we went heavy on Pokemon Go back when that came out and uh, I'm, I'm kind of an, an earlier Pokemon guy, you know what I mean? Like I was Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3, that area, really heavy into it, kind of fell out of it over time but i still love it i still pay attention to it obviously we've got some crazy stuff going on lately with the trading card game and you know logan paul's got his box break this weekend that i'm looking forward to watching and stuff like that but uh here in 50 seconds we've got uh, a pokemon presents like live stream or whatever i think we're gonna get some new news and um not gonna lie i, I saw a little leak of what we might be seeing here it looks absolutely insane and it's gonna change pokemon forever 25 years, bro. That makes me feel so old. It was what, like three and a half when it first came out? That's wild. 1996. Red, green. Cable. Trade. Dude. Trading card. Anime. Oh, the anime was so fantastic. The movie made me cry. Blue and yellow. This is cool to see. I had one of these too, no way, dude. The Pocket Pikachu, is that what it was called? Can't wait for the new Pokemon Snap too. I started in Gen 1, but I feel like Gold, Silver, and even, um, uh, what's it called? With Suicune there on the, the left. What was that called? Crystal. Crystal was, was probably my favorite. Oh, dude, this, yes! Pokemon Go! My favorite time in video games right there. Probably my favorite video game of all time. Maybe GTA 5. Pokemon Go was incredible. It brought the world together in a way that it never had been before, and then we all got ripped apart this year in a way we never have been before. It's just incredible how far it's, it's come. It's amazing how many lives have been touched. It's all possible. In your hands. And now we're going to find out what the future of Pokemon holds. It's been 25 great years, but what's next? Hello everyone. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. February 27th is the date Pokemon Red and Pokemon Green were released in Japan marking the beginning of the Pokemon series. I didn't know the there was a Pokemon Green. 25 years have passed since the Pokemon series was born. We've shared so much with you over the past 25 years through our games, but also through so many other mediums, thanks to the support you've all shown us. Thank you, each and every one of you. Today, Mr. Utsunomiya will introduce our latest updates. Hello there, my name is Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. First, I'd like to give you the latest update on the new Pokemon Snap game. We've put together a video that will show you some of the gameplay. Please have a look. Sweet. This actually looks really fun. I don't know if it's going to be a good YouTube series. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'll try it. I'll upload a video or two, see if you guys enjoy it. But I'm looking forward to playing this myself. Maybe Welcome play it with Chels. Welcome to Chels. the world of new Pokemon Snap. This is the Lentil region. You'll ride the Neo One through the jungle, across the desert, and even under the sea to research Pokemon in their natural habitats. Yeah, dude, this is gonna be sick. And of course, you won't be alone. Professor Mirror, who's doing research in the Lentil region, and research team members Rita and Phil are there to support you. So you're in good hands. Now then, let's get that research started. 
By watching wild Pokemon, you can discover behaviors huh. and expressions that are rarely seen. Look! A surfing Alolan Raichu! And there's Vaporeon! Let's try throwing it a fluff fruit. That's it. Now's our chance. Oh, he looks happy. Oh, it's Tyranitar. What a wild way to eat. Here's a park at night. Let's try playing a melody. Pincer and Hoot Hoot. Oh, that sure made Hoot Hoot happy. You'll also have Illumina Orbs, something the professor invented. If you use one of these, you can make any Pokemon glow. Some nice nighttime photography could be kind of cool. Whoa, those flames changed color. Venusaur. Use the tools to take shots that really stand out. Then, show the photos you took to the professor. Oh, four stars. We captured a rare moment there. Catch a variety of different behaviors on camera to fill up your Pokemon photo decks. And there's more. You'll be able to edit the photos you've taken. Dude, this is cool. This is going to be so chill. Like stickers and frames to make your favorite photos even more special. And I'm sure you'll want to show off your best photos, that right? That doesn't look, really look we that good. We know that feeling well. When you want to do that, it's time to go online. You can share your favorite photos and check out photos from around the world. And if your photo becomes popular, it might even be featured and get more attention. Seeing something like that may inspire you to go back and take even more photos. We're getting closer to the start of your adventure. Unexplored islands and plenty of Pokemon await in the Lentil region. So make sure you're prepared. I mean, it's chill. It's it's not going to be the Whoa, most exciting game in the world, but it's... Pokemon Celebi? It's going to be beautiful. You better snap that photo. The Lentil region is waiting for you. It's going to be chill. You're going to be able to just see some Pokemon in their natural habitats, take photos of them. Easy peasy. Oh, shoot. This is it. Another story awaits. Pokemon series enters a new era, bro. I'm, oh, I'm so excited. This is a tale from a long, long time ago, when the Sinnoh region was still only a vast wilderness. It's a Sinnoh prequel. A certain village bustled with the comings and goings of people, while in the mountains and seas, Pokemon roamed as they pleased. Open world Pokemon game. No longer turn based. Open world. Bro, what? I'm so excited for this. I've wanted this forever. I, I wanted this 10 years ago. We just that's that's catching a Pokemon right there. That's catching a Pokemon. You you run around and you you sneak up on them and you catch them. You can literally be the trainer. You aren't on a yellow brick road. You're not. You know, forced into turn base that sort of thing. It's 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 real. It's real. We've got starters from three different generations. I'm picking Cyndaquil. Give me more deets. We got a release date. Pokemon Legends. Arceus, 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 worldwide early 2022. I I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the Pokemon video game series, both taking place in the Sinnoh region. 
First, I'd like to present the Pokémon Brilliant Diamond and Pokémon Shining Pearl games. These are faithful remakes of the Pokémon Diamond version and Pokémon cool. Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system in Japan 15 years ago. So we got Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. That's that's going to be cool. Next, but I'm going to be honest. This introduce you to the Pokémon Legends this is Arceus it. game. Pokémon Legends Arceus represents a new approach for the Pokémon video game series. Development is in full swing at Game Freak, with the aim to deliver a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokémon series. Please have a look at this video. So it's got Game Freak's full attention. This is what they're working on. They've got another year or so to work on it. Obviously a the work in progress. The events of this game unfold in the Sinnoh of old. And this time too, Mount Coronet towers over the center of the region. Pokemon live freely in the wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region you remember. In this era, people have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and founded a prosperous village in the hope of learning more about this land. As for these three Pokemon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor who encountered them while traveling around various regions. You'll set off on your adventure after receiving a first partner Pokemon of your own from this professor. Of course. Cyndaquil all day, baby. With the village as your base, you'll venture out to the different corners of the region on your quest to create Sinnoh's very first Pokedex. Even in this era, wild Pokemon can be caught with Pokeballs. You can also engage in Pokemon battles alongside your Pokemon allies. So they do kind of have a little bit Sharpen of a turn base. skills for both catching and battling Pokemon and strive to complete your Pokedex. It's not too far off of, of where it was before. You start to weaken them and... Now for the mythical Pokemon that graces the game's title and story, Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. But how is this Pokemon connected to your journey? The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new action RPG adventure for the Nintendo Switch system. Dude, this is gonna be so good. I wonder if we get the Switch Pro by then too. Been rumors about that. Who knows, it's not official yet. So there you guys have it, not a ton of, of I mean that. So there you guys have it, a massive new development out of Game Freak, a, a Pokemon game and a new style that we've never seen before. They're really branching out here, which honestly I think is amazing. I can't wait to check this out. Obviously, still very early access. They didn't really show us that much about it, but just knowing the fact that it's currently being worked on is incredible, and I cannot wait for 2022. 2022 looks like it's going to be a fantastic year for games. We're just going to have to get through 2021 first, which is not going to be good. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Peace out.